my lovelies welcome back to the channel it is a cloudy overcast day here in southern utah but i think you're gonna agree with me on this one it's about time we see some wheeling action on this channel but before we take mischief maker out we've just got to the shop i'm gonna head on in we're gonna switch out that front bumper to one that matches the rear a couple of weeks ago i actually switched out the rear bumper at matt's off road he helped me with tom tom and we actually made the rear bumper extremely extremely durable and strong so that when i go on a recovery with him with mischief maker hopefully he won't bend my bumper again third time is not a charm so uh we're gonna switch out the front one to a crawl tech crawl tech is actually a sister company of fox and fox has been a big part of the nessie build and they sent some high clearance bumpers for us to try out so that's exactly what we're gonna do now they are a little bit of a different and darker look we're gonna change up mischief maker just a little bit i mean it's really they're really 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 small changes but I feel like it's gonna make a big difference. And you guys are gonna be able to see all of that at EJS when we have finished all the little touch-ups that we're doing. But anywho's, enough talking, let's head on in, let's get this bumper done so that we can get out onto the mountain today. All right, well, it looks like the front is off and the new one is there. So let's get this on there. Well, that clearly didn't work. Okay, so we actually had a high clearance bumper on here before, but we're gonna have to chop about half an inch off the frame to get this nice and snug there. So uh, I've measured it half an inch. I'm going to take the Sawzall, I'm going to take that off, and then we're going to put the bumper on. All right guys, it is actually the day after. Why? Well, because Marvin came into town. So Marvin is here, but we can't show you exactly what is going on with Marvin and his vehicle, but you will see that in an upcoming episode. So we have uh, Mischief Maker running. We have this coming with us. We have Rudicon. We have Trail Haunter. I mean, what more could you want? So we're gonna go hit some trails finally today. Excited? I'm super excited. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> All right, let's go make this happen. Okay, we are up at the water tanks. We've been unloading. We have a buggy, we have a YJ. <laughs> we have Trail Haunter, myself. We have a rig that I can't show you, but again, in the next couple of episodes, you'll be able to see that because Marvin will have already released what he has bought in Washington. So very excited for you guys to see that. And we're gonna be hitting Double Sammy today. Rudy has never hit Double Sammy. He freaking lives here. I don't think Trail Hunter's ever done Double Sammy. And she has a new rig or a new build. So we're gonna do a shakedown with that. 
and we're gonna go see what uh, Marvin can do with his mystery vehicle. Boop. Before we leave, Rudy and I have something in common today. We've got our little Onyx hats on. His looks a little warmer than mine today, to be honest with you. But we're gonna be tracking our trail today because Rudy's never done double Sammy before. That's right. I'm gonna pull out my map, turn on my track feature. And then go and track. Go and track. And record. So we're gonna record our track today, which is kind of cool, because then you can go back to it whenever you want. He's swishing around with the phone now. That's cool. So we're gonna hop on in. If you guys are interested in getting the Onyx Off-Road app, then click the link in the description below. But now we have wheeling to do. There's too much talking going on. Let's go. go. So we're at the beginning of Double Sammy and for some reason Max has gone off playing but let's see what Marvin is up to. Wait! Wait what? Wow. Alright! The new bumper guys! Bam! Let's see what Rudy thinks about Mischief Maker. Basically a stock crawl ratio to stock Cherokee on really? 30s. So we're at, I think this vehicle is a 96 total crawl ratio. 538 at the axles, 5 to 1. Four point something first. Wow. These bars would probably get my way. Oh yeah, well you're a little tall. Oh, this is nice. I can get used to this. I'll, uh, I'll trade you straight across. <laughs> I'll even There's leave. There's a lot of fab work into yours though. Yeah, but it's not worth <laughs> nearly as much. <laughs> Fair enough. Deal. We'll deal. a deal. Tell Holly. Yeah. We'll trade titles when we get back to the parking lot. Sounds good. <laughs> I'm driving the Rudicott.
Stop right there. A little that way. Come on, go. Thank you. That way. Thank you. Perfect. You got it. Yeah, that's definitely not working though.
fantastic day on the trails. Honestly, the second part of the day, I didn't get a lot of footage just because we were moving through the trails pretty pretty well, to be honest with you. Uh, but what an incredible day. Uh, we had Marvin here. Um, I got to drive the Rudicon, for goodness sake iconic which was really cool and actually maybe we should do a vehicle swap what do you guys think like maybe i should drive rudicon on a whole trail and he should drive mischief maker aka the tank for a whole trail i'm thinking that might be a really really cool video to do let me know what you think in the comments below but now we're just off grabbing something to eat a little team dinner if you will i'm absolutely hank marvin starving so i'm gonna leave it there for today but guys thank you so much for watching the channel and we will see you guys the next time